Courtney and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited you're here because today is a very, very special day. So I had the immense honor of being able to design a Disney princess inspired collection just for you, all centered around Princess Tiana from Princess and the Frog. And today I wanted to give you an exclusive first look at all the pieces and share a little of the design inspiration that went into each one. I hope you're excited, let's do it. So the first piece I wanted to show you from the collection is actually Disney ears. I love ears. I have too many pairs to count, so I was so excited when they said I got to design a pair inspired by Tiana. I actually already knew what I wanted because I've had this design in my head for years. I love Tiana's crown. I think it's like one of the cutest crowns, so I wanted to kind of recreate this with the ears. I also love that Tiana has such a great color palette, so I wanted to kind of do like an ombre effect to show some of her colors in the ears. We did some pearl details here to dress it up and designed them with soft velvet so that they're perfect for girls with curls and anyone else. I mean, I'm probably a little bit biased, but these are my new favorite ears. I think I'll have to wear these every time I go to the park. Maybe if you're there wearing them too, we could twin. Let's talk about clothes. There are quite a few pieces in the collection, starting with this Tiana tee. For this design, we actually dug into the archives and we pulled all the reference images and original artwork for the movie. I fell in love with this sketch because I thought she looked so stunning and her dress kind of was flowing in this fun way. It kind of gave me like a color me feel, but also was obviously true to Tiana. It was also something I hadn't really seen before, so I thought this would be great to use as a staple t-shirt. There are a few cute details on the shirt, like this yellow striped collar and the side slit with a pop of yellow underneath. Disney's Princess and the Frog was actually one of the last full-length animated movies to use hand animation, so I love that this shirt kind of gave like a nod to that history. The next piece I wanted to show you was the Tiana Varsity jacket. This was another design I knew I wanted instantly. I just thought it'd be so cool to have like a Tiana inspired varsity jacket. Tiana's an entrepreneur, so I thought that this would be like a fun nod to like that collegiate style. We started with this really beautiful teal green color, which is very true to Tiana, but we also introduced some other colors. This golden yellow color, which is kind of a nod to her yellow dress in the beginning of the movie. Some pinks to make it pop. We have a tee for Tiana, and we did this two-tone diagonal thing, which is just true to Color Me Courtney branding. I've always used like a diagonal stripe in a lot of my personal brands. On this pocket here, it reads Dreams Made Real. There's a little Tiana emblem. And then on the other side it says 09 because the movie came out in 2009. Inside the O is Ramon. If you love Ray, you're in luck because you'll see him throughout the collection. But my favorite part is the back. We have embroidery of Tiana's restaurant and then it says almost there. So this serves as a reminder to chase your dreams. So whatever your goal is, keep working. You're almost there. I really wanted this collection to be both casual and dressy, functional and fashionable, so I made sure to include a tulle skirt. Princess Tiana has over nine outfit changes in her movie. That's the most we've seen of any Disney princess. So I wanted this skirt to represent three of her iconic looks. We have the blue for her blue dress. This is kind of the first time she sees herself as a princess before she goes on her whole journey throughout the movie. This minty green color for her iconic princess dress that we see at the end of the movie during the transformation scene. And yellow for her working dress. This is what we see her wear at the beginning of the movie and kind of the start of her journey. There's over six layers of tulle here, so it's really fun to wear, but we did a lightweight tulle so it would be comfortable. We made sure it was lined with a lightweight material too. Although elastic waistbands can be really comfortable on a skirt, I don't love the way they look, so we made the back elastic but the front, this like kind of flat ribbon design, so you don't need a belt, you could just wear it as is. And you won't want a belt because we wrote Princess Tiana up here on the corner, included a little icon. This is something that you could dress up with heels or dress down with sneakers. I would wear this with white sneakers and the t-shirt to the park. This next look is perfect if you want to show your Tiana spirit. We designed this cute varsity hoodie with a Tiana emblem on the front. I wanted to amp up Tiana's iconic color scheme just a smidge, so we kind of went neon with this green. We wanted to keep the varsity vibe going strong, so we added this T here in the center with some megaphones. There's also a little crown. And these are rhinestones so that they sparkle. On the eyelets, we added a pop of color with pink and used the same pink to trim the 09 on the sleeve. The sleeves kind of balloon out just to make it a little bit more fashion forward, and there is a pocket here on the front. So I hope when anyone wears this, they can kind of feel like Tiana's cheering them on. 
We're going a little bit more dressy with this next look for this yellow inspired gown. Again, I wanted this collection to be wearable in the parks, but also beyond, so like in your everyday life. I love that this dress has like a subtle nod to Tiana. You might recognize this print. It's actually inspired by one of my favorite scenes in the movie. So towards the end of the movie, when we have Tiana's big transformation moment, the background in that image is just so stunning. So I actually took a screen grab, zoomed it in, and sent that to Disney and was like, can we turn this into a print? And they did, and it's amazing. We made sure to do it in a flowy maxi dress so that you could twirl in it and have your own princess moment. We have some ruffle details here on the sleeve. This top part is elastic so it's really comfortable. Perfect to wear all day at the parks or anywhere else. This one could also be dressed up or dressed down. It was really important to all of us that this collection felt inclusive so we also designed kind of a unisex option that really anyone can wear. It's just like a perfect chambray short sleeve shirt. Paris has been wearing this shirt non-stop. He usually wears it with white pants. I would wear it tied over a skirt or a white dress. We created another print for this one so we kind of took her iconic flowers and blew them up then added some mint and white so that it really pops on that blue denim. There are a few kind of hidden nods in this top. Ray is hiding out here on the collar, it says Princess Tiana on the pocket, and Tiana's here on the sleeve too. If you like this print, get excited because there's something else coming later on that utilizes it. That's all I can say for now, but stay tuned. Let's talk about jewelry. We have two different jewelry pieces for this collection. I wanted to make sure we did earrings in a pack of two because I like to mix match my earrings. So I would probably wear one from here and one from here. So truly, this kind of gives you three different sets. You could wear this as a set, this as a set, or mix match them for a third option. We also have a matching necklace and this kind of gives a nod to all of the colors that we see in the collection and also all of the colors that Tiana wears. I love charm bracelets. They've always been like really important to me. When I first moved to New York to chase my dreams, my mom bought me a New York City charm bracelet and I wore it on the plane. There's actually like a really old photo of me like with my ticket in my hand and I just remember being like nervous to set out on this new adventure. So I kind of wanted to capture that, but in a necklace. So we have this charm necklace so that you can kind of keep your dreams close to your heart when you wear it. We also designed some things for your home, like these amazing mugs. When Disney said I got to design a mug, I knew immediately exactly what I wanted. I wanted to recreate the tin that sits on Tiana's dresser that says restaurant fun. We see this in the beginning of the movie. As she's putting all her tips in there, it sits right next to the photo of her dad and she's kind of talking to him about her journey. I know so many people start the day with a warm beverage, so I kind of thought seeing this first thing in the morning might be a good way to kick things off on the right foot. We also wanted to give you a travel mug option. So for this one here, we brought this same sketch into a taller mug design, but it's two-sided. So on the other side, you have like a closer look at Tiana's silhouette. I love these sketches because this is the way I wear my hair almost every day, and we can see some of her curls coming through. These look like kind of fashion sketches, and I think that's a really beautiful thing to have on a mug, on a t-shirt, or anywhere else. We also designed a Tiana makeup bag that matches back to the rest of the collection. One more thing we designed for your home is this Tiana artwork set. We dug into the Disney archives for this to find five prints for you in this collection. They're all more fashion forward looking sketches and they're really stunning. We did a variety of sizes so that you could use them all together in a set or sprinkle them throughout your home. We made sure to include some smaller sizes too so that you could put them on your desk or anywhere that you're working away chasing your dreams. Let's move on to accessories. <laughs> you may have noticed that I love a headband. I'm pretty much always wearing one. So we wanted to design one for this collection, but actually design two. So this is a set that comes together and there are two different colorways of that print. So this yellow one will match back to the yellow dress. It looks so cute on. And this mint colored one is the same print in a different color and we added some pearls on here. Super cute. We use this kind of scrunchy design in the headband because it's kind of a nod back to a crown. If you love that floral print in mint, don't worry, because we designed a bag to match. So for this, we kind of did a swing bag style. Here you can see that reimagined print in this green mint colorway. And we brought back that Tiana sketch here on the back. Twins, it has a top zipper. Whoop. 
but made sure there were a ton of ways you could wear it. So the most common way would be over your shoulder or in that arm crease. It also comes with a gold chain. So you can wear it crossbody. All of the straps are removable. I'm short, but from my previous life when I worked in handbags, I know that sometimes a crossbody strap can be too short or too tall for certain people. So we wanted to make this one long enough for pretty much anyone, but give you the option to shorten it to whatever length you want. You just use the clasp, Clip it through at the length you want to make an O, then clip it one more time to the bag, and now it's shorter. We also designed this cute purse. This one's kind of inspired by vintage luggage. Princess and the Frog takes place in the 20s, so I thought this would be a fun nod to the era, but we made sure to make it modern with a fun color scheme, bold emblem, and Tiana details. It says 09 on this side, and there's a little sparkle, a crown, a megaphone with a T. So this would be really cute to pair with the hoodie or the varsity jacket. This one also has a crossbody strap or a top handle. We like a collection with options. For this one, I was directly inspired by the opening scene where Tiana's like running to catch the cable car. She doesn't have a suitcase in that scene, but every time I imagine it, I think of it with a suitcase. We had already designed this, but then recently Disney released the artwork for the new series coming to Disney Plus, all centered around Tiana. She has a really similar look to what she wears in the opening of the movie, but she's running and she's holding a suitcase. So I thought that was really exciting that what I pictured in my head, the animators who were working on the Tiana series also saw that for her. More hair accessories. So again, in that same opening scene, we see Tiana in this like kind of cute 20s inspired olive hat and she's hiding under there reading what I believe is a cooking magazine and kind of dreaming on her commute. So I kind of wanted to bring that to life with this hat. On this side here, it says dreams made real. And then on the other side, we have her signature flower and Ray. There's also this removable tie in that same yellow print. So you could take it off, you could wear it somewhere else. You could add it to the Tiana sling bag if you wanted. You've got options. Speaking of options, it's reversible. On the inside, we have this mint print, which is kind of a combination of what we saw on the unisex shirt and what we see in the Tiana sling bag. Her crown is right here. And if you did want to wear it this way, you could take the yellow tie and tie it underneath your chin or take it off entirely. Making this style reversible also gives you the option to like flip up your brim to show like a reveal on either side. Some of you wrote in and asked some questions about the collection, so I wanted to make sure to answer them. Paris, read me the questions. Do you have a favorite item or one particular piece that you're most excited about to launch? Do I have a favorite item? Uh, no, because I like all of it. I think designing iconic Disney ears was really special and kind of like a standout moment. Truly, I love so many of these pieces so much. Like a varsity jacket, I've always wanted a Tiana varsity jacket. This tool skirt is so signature to me, something I always wear. So to have it in like this ombre Tiana color palette is like very exciting. The bag, I love this bag so much because I love the artwork. And this bag, you guys know I love like small bags. So to have this one be like old meets new in like a Tiana on a collection is very special. I, I love it all. What are the predominant colors in the collection? So for this collection, we started with Tiana's color palette, which there's so much of it because she has so many looks. Then we kind of sprinkled in some other colors that made sense to make things cohesive so that the whole collection and all the pieces work together. But to answer your question, here's the main color palette of the collection. Where will the collection be sold? So this collection will officially launch at D23 Expo. I'll be speaking at a panel there. It will be in the D23 Marketplace, and then it will be available on shopdisney.com and in Disney parks worldwide. Worldwide! That's, I, I don't know, that's so wild. What's your favorite Disney memory? Ooh, I have so many amazing Disney memories. Like just this year, we got to visit Walt Disney World for the 50th anniversary and be the first to sail on Disney's newest cruise ship, the Disney Wish. Obviously, I think designing this collection will become one of my new favorite Disney memories. I love seeing a new Disney movie right when it comes out, either on Disney Plus or in the movie theaters. And I also really love anytime I get to meet you guys at the parks. That's always so exciting to be able to meet you in the most magical place on earth. Like, what could be better? Thank you so much for watching this video and so much for supporting me because really the reason I'm granted these opportunities is because of you. So I hope you enjoy this collection. I can't wait for you to shop it. It will launch at D23 Expo and then become available on Shop Disney and in Disney parks worldwide September 9th. I can't wait to see you wear it. If you wanna see more videos, make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you later. Okay, I love you, goodbye.